oh my gosh look what i have <laughs> oh my gosh i'm so excited about this product this is like my first ever youtuber slash um makeup collaboration purchase of any kind and i'm so excited to be reviewing this one from the good sis bretman rock <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Rika and I'm back for another video. This video is going to be an unboxing slash first impressions of the new Morphe slash Bretman Rock Babe in Paradise highlighter pad. And let me tell you, I'm so excited about this one. This is the first time I've ever purchased a collab with any YouTuber and a makeup line. So I'm super excited about this. And what's even better, it's a highlighting palette and me. I love a good highlight and that's like my favorite makeup item to use so I'm super excited about this and yeah if you want to see how this product wears and looks on darker skin tones definitely stick around so basically this is what it looks like out of the the box I don't know how to describe this color I say it's like a, a muted kind of tan and then over it they do have a floral elements lots of birds and they're definitely giving you a, a tropical vibe with the packaging this is what the back of it looks like and there's Bretman Rock right there I like him so much I follow him on Instagram and on Twitter and he's definitely so much fun to watch I love his energy I love his sense of humor he's just such a fun person all around so yeah <laughs> So yeah, this is basically what the back looks like and then on there written it says Babe in Paradise Highlighter Palette. So it says, Welcome to Highlighter Paradise. Who better than Bretman Rock to handpick six daringly creamy highlighters to suit every Morphe babe under the sun? I know, like who? Really? <laughs> then it says, Peach please, you've never seen or felt highlighters this bomb before. Pair this with our custom. Pair this with our custom fan brush and you're good to glow. No. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and open the box for you guys. And then right off the bat, you can see that it's been bubble wrapped to prevent it from getting any damage during transit, which is pretty good. So let's slide that out. So this is what the palette looks like out the box and you do get a fan brush thank god because I, I was meaning to get me a new fan brush so the bristles are super soft so this is what it looks like out the box you do get the highlighting palette and a brush um let's jump into the palette it's so pretty it kind of blue is kind of like hollow graphic if that's the word or iridescent it kind of has that kind of feel to it when you when you move it and of course the plants and the birds and there really does give it a tropical kind of feel kind of vibe right so when you open the palette ooh, such a nice blue oh it looks so nice against my backdrop <laughs> there's a shield thing thingy not really sure what to call this but they, they put it over product to prevent any kind of damage or transfer or things like that so let's remove that and this is what it looks like super pretty super 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 pretty so up top there it has a little note and it says mahalo for supporting your fave babe in paradise growing up on the islands gave me a diverse perspective on life that i want to share with you hope this part captures the essence of paradise beauty bye bitch so bretman rock <laughs> so bretman rock if you watch him like bitch is like his favorite word so roll my sleeves up to do this swatch yeah need some arm room to, to do the swatch 
the first impression is just by looking at the colors in the pan I must say that they are very pretty I'm going to be reading them out and I'll try to do swatches on my hand as we go the first one is baby girl which is this color right here so that's baby girl the next one is vacation the next one the next color right here is mahu the next one down here it's called get laid some very interesting names <laughs> running out of space guys <laughs> uh, the next one is called Chihu I think Chihu is going to be my favorite that's really pretty and finally I need more space Then finally, the last color I'm going to swatch is this one right here, and it's called Shady Bitch. Shady Bitch. So, so these are my swatches. This is what they look like. Now that we've swatched them and we've seen the colors it's time to try it on the face and I'm so excited to try that out I haven't done any highlighter or blush today I'm gonna be playing around with this palette to see how it looks on my skin typically for me I like to apply highlighter on the cheeks the nose along the bridge the cupid's bow chin forehead I love highlighters so I'm gonna be applying this palette the way I regularly do playing with the colors as I go and then I'll give my final thoughts and opinions on the palette at the end so I think I'm going to try this color to bronze a trick that I saw Bretman use in his video he said to mix this shade with your bronzer and that will have a nice finish that will have a nice effect on the skin so I'm going to try that and yeah we'll see how it works
Alright guys, so here you have it, my final look with the Bretman and Morphe Baby in Paradise palette. Super pretty, very easy to use. I love the versatility of this palette so much. For me, you had me at the price and it doesn't hurt that the product is pretty awesome as well. For me, my favorite um, shade from this so far is definitely going to be Mahu. I really like Mahu. It's a super vibrant gold color I use it all over my face today and I just see me just go and I just see myself going pretty crazy with Mahu so yes I'm definitely happy I picked this up another highlighted palette that I can add to my collection and of course I'll get a lot of wear out of it as well so final thoughts would i recommend this do i recommend that you guys go out and give it a try well i don't know if it's still available for purchase uh but if it is do i think it's worth it hmm i mean in the words of bretman rock um i guess it's cute or whatever <laughs> i know that's like the worst impression Final thoughts, is it worth it? Absolutely, definitely worth it guys. Definitely go out and give this a try. Let me know in the comment section down below if you've tried this and what your thoughts are. Um, as always guys, I do thank you so much for watching and I hope you liked this video. Give me a big thumbs up if you do. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Please, please, please subscribe to my channel and I will see you in my next one. Bye, bitch. <laughs>